Hello mate, welcome to another epic production of our newest app. The Bay Planner app decodes and displays content of Baply file. It doesn't change or edit original source file. Bay Planner doesn't expect any input from user except path to Baply file that is to be decoded. It does not assume size of the vessel unless specified. Although built on Baply version 3.0.2 it has backward compatibility and can safely be used on all Baply version. Although not needed, adding a ship using a fully loaded EDI will get a list of all bays, rows and maximum height, however this feature is included as this will prepare your vessel with complete profile. You specify the number of bays, odd numbers only, 40 foot bay will be created based on two odd number bays. Ok the ship is created. Let us load MEDI. We tap get Baply tap and then we enter the name of the file which is located on an USB memory card affixed to the mobile unit. Please note that you must follow the protocol of putting file with three slashes as shown and then enter the file path with file name. The system will read the file and let you know the number of container it has. It will then give you an estimated time of completion. Each container is verified and each port is verified, the system approximately takes about a minute for 1000 containers, this will vary by models. If you are on iPhone or do not have access to memory card, then you can use the Wii method. Simply go to the website http colon slash slash www.avasetdata.com slash shipmate, upload the file, get the file location token and enter it here. Please note that you must use http prefix and the complete path as shown in the website. Once the BAPLY has been converted, we can now view the information bay by bay. Click on the bay number on top to get a detail view of the container bay, if you click any conatiner then the detail of that consiner is shown, you can check the port code, change vessel if you have multiple profile. In the summary section you get a list of all containers which you can sort by columns, the port summary shows you containers for the port and TTHEIMDG tab will show you the dangerous goods containers. You can find slash locate a container simply by putting in the Kona Tiner number. That's all for now folk. Please do not forget to keep updating this app. Thank you for watching.